Ah, found the button at the last. Let's try to find the button there. Hello, it is Hamish the Polar Bear. I started making a video, uh, a vlog, about my current streaming and video making setup. So I'm waving my hand over here, I'm off camera. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, it got a bit rambly, so I'm going to do a new one, short one, to the point, not like this introduction, and show you all about it, and then tell you what's going on. So here we go, I'm just going to flip the camera around. There we go, I can see what's going on now. And show you the, the deal at the moment. So, at the moment we have Hamish's biggest fan. We have the uh, Behringer UFX 1604. Do, do, do. Mixing desk. Uh, this is an analog mixing desk, but it has a 1604 out USB and firewire connection uh, as well, which I'm currently using as the sound card. So this is currently my sound card, a 1604 out sound card, uh, and it's it's a good mixer. I, I like it. You know, nice mixer. Yeah. Anyway, uh, router, headphones, done my orange juice, uh, my Kobo. What book am I reading at the moment? Let's have a look. Uh, God, I'm not very good at camera business. Ah, Neil deGrasse Tyson, of course. Astrophysics for people in a hurry. Uh, it's still quite deep, but I like astrophysics and stuff like that, so it's okay. My Pandora, open Pandora. I, I don't know what I'm not showing you these for, because these are nothing to do with streaming at the moment, but the, the Pandora might be, so let's just go with that. Uh, there we go, alright, so here at the moment is unused, more or less, audio equipment. Uh, oh, I'll put the patch bay, it's a, bit, a, bit, a little bit used. So, from top to bottom we've got a patch bay. Actually, I'm going to start that again. Damn it, I'm going to have to edit this, aren't I? There's no escape. Okay. Da, 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 da. Let's go back to the... Uh, uh, yeah, okay. So. So here we have uh, speakers. Do, 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 speakers, oops, microphones in the way. A microphone on a little springy uh, stand. We have the big screen, which is a 27 inch. You have to get back, it's so big. That's what she said. Uh, 27 inch uh, widescreen, and then we have here at the moment a single 19 inch uh, 4 by 4 3 screen. And do, 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 a crappy um, little uh, webcam. We have ourselves a Rokat Rios TKL Pro keyboard and a Rokat uh, uh, Korn XTD uh, mouse. Uh, uh, sorry, old man noises. And we have a steam controller. Do, do, do. Yeah, steam controller with loads of fire buttons. See? Loads of them. There's, there's four there, a few there. Loads more fire buttons on the top and everything. Oh god, it's, it's, and on the bottom. It's crazy. Um, and we have, uh, what's the other thing I was going to say? Oh yes, <laughs> I just, what I was going to say I just realised is, is, is a lack of something. So we have no light. There's no uh, special light for the streaming or video making. So that's something I want to remedy. Um, maybe we have something over in that corner and something over there. But at the moment I haven't got proper light so it's, it's, it's not ideal. Uh, what I do have though is I've got like a stand-up lamp and I've obviously the you know the, the the normal room light. So you know people, I'm not completely invisible when I'm on stream and stuff, but it's not ideal. Uh, I was going to go into the computer and do the uh, the setup there, but I'm going to try left-handed mousing instead and just show you on the camera just to make this as quick as possible because I did start doing it before and it got way out of hand. Uh, this is the controls for a system called Jack, which is an audio connection system. In fact, it stands for Jack Audio Connection Kit. It is a Linuxy thing, so it's a recursive acronym. Uh, can I get that as focused? Don't know if I can. Anyway, let's try and zoom in a bit. There we go. Right, point is, this is uh, how, the, how the sound connects at the moment. So there you've got everything goes into and out of uh, Pulse Audio, which I hate, but we'll come back to that another time. So at the moment everything's in a honking great uh, stereo feed. Uh, that's the inputs and outputs for the sound card. So you can see there, all the system sounds get fed to the two channels on the sound card for stereo. And at the moment the microphone is hooked up to the input of Pulse Audio for uh, you know talking on uh, Discord and the like. 
No, no, no. I'm, I'm rejigging this a bit because I can't do the left-handed mouse I discovered. Oh yeah, the red boxes are to do with MIDI, which I'm not using at the moment. More of that in the next video. Uh, right, I'm just going to fire up OBS in an effort to show you. Right, let's move this over here. Oops. Okay, let's... Ah, there we go. Right, so this is OBS. This is um, left in the seat it was at the end of the last stream, so let's... Uh, Let's just go for well, I don't matter, I'm not going to do anything with it anyway. Uh, as you can see, uh, there's lots of stuff there. Um, there's two boxes there on the bottom left. One is scenes and then the next one is sources. Scenes are like collections of uh, sources, duh, um, which you put together and switch between to make a show. Uh, I have on that list at the moment, not very many, I've got start card, main, end card, be right back and big Hamish. Uh, Big Hamish, just so I'll, I'll show you what there. Well, start card is pretty pretty obvious. It's the show is starting soon thing. Uh, main is the main one. So in here you would have web. Well, why have I not got the webcam? I'm not sure why. Oh, there you go. Technical difficulties even on. There we go. Ah, oh my God, it's me with the big camera. Or well, medium sized camera. Uh, so uh, in here you've got like several sources. So this is the second box of sources. Uh, so you've got like my web address, so if I switch that on off you'll see what happens. It's just that address that shows up there. Um, so audio and visual sources, so I've got desktop audio which is connected to the... Ah, that's the other thing I was going to show you. So I will connect jack audio to the pulse audio. And that goes to my desktop audio in there. So so that's, you know, some things I can get connected. But you see that the problem at the moment, the crux of it all, is that all of this and all of that is everything that goes in and out of the computer uh, for Jack Audio. Jack is brilliant. You can actually get separate sound sources and, and connect them all like you can with a proper mixer. Uh, Pulse Audio kind of gets in the way of that and it's hard to avoid these days on Linux. It's pretty much the de facto standard sound system. You can avoid it, but it's a lot of hassle. Uh, also, you see there is, uh, on there there's another audio source. It's the mic. So if you see there, I've, I've got a mic. So if I do that and that... And then if I switch on the microphone, doo -doo -doo, you should see it moving around when I speak on the mic. There we go, yes. Hello, hello, hello. So that's that's basically that's how it's set up at the moment. Oh, that's how it's set up at the moment. Sorry, I flicked the uh, I flicked the lens cover on. <laughs> I'm an expert at this uh, video lark. Uh, right. So you've got all your audio and visual sources and uh, there's there's a few extra things in there, like there's a like a web stuff so you've got chat so when people are talking in uh, when there's a live stream on that little box there will have chat going up through it uh, the webcam obviously is that thing there where you can see me let's see if we can do something trippy and cool and uh, meter there we go Ooh. I'm on the webcam I'm on the main cam yeah okay <laughs> got carried away with that so uh, so this collection of sources goes to a scene and you can set set any collection of sources, sorry there it is, uh, this collection of sources goes to each scene and you can switch them together into big groups. So like I've got start card which is just basically there's a bit of hold music that plays from a file, uh, there's the web address again which can play somewhere different see, um, the alerts and chat are on so um, oops, alerts are uh, when people does a follow or whatever it comes up with a little animation. Uh, starting is just that text box there, and background is, believe it or not, the background. So main you saw, because uh, that's basically all those same things, a background, blah blah blah. Also, when it, obviously when I'm playing a game, it'll either take up a, a section of the screen or the full screen. Sorry, I dipped the camera there. Gosh, I, I, I won't get a job in camera work very soon, that's for sure. Right, uh, and I've also got like an end card, which shows the schedule, uh, and a thank you for watching. Be right back for when I have to nip to the lure or whatever. Or take the dog for a pee, that kind of thing. Uh, these are all just text boxes, most of these ones, and the sources. And uh, there is this this one, which isn't really used for anything at the moment, but this is what I call Big Hamish. No, it's not a euphemism. Uh, this is just basically the webcam in bigger in a bigger view. So, uh, a microphone. So you can see the audio audio sources. Oh yeah, that's the other thing I was going to say. The audio sources at the moment. So the microphone is on there, because I've got it switched on, so you can see the little green bar moving when I, uh, when I talk to the our talk. Uh, Be Right Back has got the hold music, which is that file music. The end card has nothing on it at all for audio. So I should actually put an audio in there, but I didn't get into it. I will do that. 
Uh, so basically what happens is you can switch between these scenes, switch off the, the camera and the microphone without having to individually switch off the camera and the microphone on the software or the hardware. So, you know, that's what the scenes are for, little, little collections of audio and video things that you stick together. Uh, there's little tools for fading it in and out and all sorts of things. Um, I am not really using much more than those basic things at the moment, but I intend to. Uh, but okay, that's for the that's for another video, video too. Uh, yeah, I think that's everything at the moment. Um, I think the only thing I want to say is the shortcomings. Yeah, the shortcomings of the system at the moment. It's quite un inconvenient because uh, uh, two monitors, especially two different monitors, can cause you a bit of problems, especially with some games. Some games just don't like it. So there's a lot of uh, workarounds and faffing. Uh, Jack on a a normal Linux kernel, uh, that is not a real-time kernel, can be a bit less than perfect for audio. Uh, it's usable, but you will hear the occasional dropout, click, squidgy noise, you know, things like that, because it really needs uh, to be on a, on a, a, a Linux kernel that's set up for audio specifically, uh, which doesn't really work particularly well with games, I don't think. I don't know, I'm not experimenting with that, so please don't write in about that one. Um, it won't matter soon anyway. The point is, I uh, want to just get to the, to, uh, well, it's one of the possibilities, so that's for the second video. But what I want to do is tidy this up. I mean, it's not too bad for me just now at the moment. Uh, I want to use all this equipment that you see around here, much more, because uh, it's all there for, for using. And um, I want to have more flexible audio routing and connecting. Most of well, I've got control over audio, so you can I can mute, you know I can make a game quieter than my microphone and all that sort of thing. But it all again, it all comes through Pulse Audio, which is like a a bottleneck. <laughs> well, it's not bottleneck. It's, it, it makes everything one stereo output, one stereo input. That's. So you don't have as much control as you do. So I can't, for example, the, the main thing, one of the main things I cannot do is when I do the live nerdy show thing that we do, Hamish's Nerd Network, every second Sunday, watch it folks, um, with a group of people, friends of mine, they can't hear when I play like an audio or a video clip or music or whatever, they can't hear it at their end because I have no way of routing it back without looping them into it and causing a huge feedback loop. Um, so there's things I want to do to, to separate all that and set it all up. Uh, with the help of uh, Benny uh, WTV, I'm not sure what that stands for, but uh, Benny, a uh, very nice chap on the uh, Linux Gamers group, uh, I got some software and hardware ideas from him and I realised that I've got other stuff around here that can help me make things more the way I want them. So, in the next video I'll show you all the bits and pieces uh, in more detail. Uh, these things uh, particularly, and uh, I'll talk about what other computer hardware I have. Now, I used to have multiple computers, but when I moved flat, I tried to sort of tidy up and streamline a bit, and, and I, I got rid of sort of old stuff. And, I, and I, I was kind of regretting it, but then I remembered I've got two laptops, uh, one that's set up as for audio studio stuff, uh, which I have never used really because I, I tend to sort of be lazy and stay on the computer here. And uh, I have another one which was uh, uh, one that I sort of got working again that was broken and uh, it seems fairly reliable and working so uh, why don't I use them? So yeah, in the next video we'll talk about that. Uh, hopefully that is uh, everything. I'm just going to flip all this around and say goodbye. Here we go, it's me again. Hello, it's Hamish. Right, uh, that was a bit rambly, but it was nowhere near as rambly as the previous video, so uh, let's hope that'll do. Uh, this has been a part one of three. Uh, oh, I just realised I'm looking at the screen, not the camera. Ooh, can you angle that? No, that's weird. Okay, I'm going to look at the camera, but now I'm not looking at the screen. It feels weird. Um, see, this is why I don't make videos. Uh, but I'm too lazy to edit, you know? So, I mean, that's why I do make videos the way I make them. I know what I mean, okay? Just, 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 do you... Don't you try and trip me up with your logic. Uh, so this is part one of three. Part one is me showing you roughly how things are set up at the moment and moaning about a couple of things. Part two will be showing you around all the equipment that I do have and talking about the software and equipment that's that's around that I do have at my disposal. I mean, there's a lot of hardware and software that, well, not software, but there's a lot of hardware I'd love to get, but it's just, you know, budget and, and, and uh, it's not gonna happen. Not, 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 uh, not for a while anyway. Uh, so the, the short version of that is, I'm going to show you what I do have, 
and talk about what I saw in Benny's video because Benny showed us a, a really cool. Um, I just really I can get comfy here. Benny showed us a really nice uh, video of much better than this. Go and watch it. I'll put a link um, uh, of his hardware, audio, and visual setup and what software he was using. And I realised that something that I thought I was going to have to either write myself or try, chunk together from other tools or whatever already exists and Benny's using it. I was like, yes! That's what I want. That's what I want. That's, that's the thing I want. Um, and also, the, it reminded me of the idea of using separate computers again. And I thought, oh, wait a minute. I've got those laptops doing virtually nothing. Um, so, uh, this weekend, in fact, today, more or less, because this is Sunday, uh, and a bit of tomorrow, probably, given it's me, it will be mostly spent tearing everything down in preparation for the new setup. So that will mean, oh, actually, means that means I'll probably be making the second video today before I do anything else to the rest of it. So uh, I will prepare for that. Uh, so get ready for another 10 15 minutes of rambling. Uh, and and that you'll love it. You will, it'll be fun. It'll be fun. We'll all, we'll all have fun. Ah. Ooh, that's not a good bit of angle, is it? There we go. Oh, going all grey beard. Ah. See, that's why I'm not on front of camera. Ah. Uh, yeah, so the, the next bit will be coming soon. I'm going to put this up on YouTube in a few minutes' time. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, if you're interested, parts two and three will be here soon, and you'll find out what bits I've got around, what I'm thinking about doing with them, and then eventually a new setup. Thanks. I've been Hamish. How do you switch this thing off? There's a button there somewhere. It's there somewhere. <laughs>